comes to this snowstorm because it looks like it's going to be a doozy. Behind me, we got Mike Hamernick already blogging on ChicagoWeatherCenter.com. On the other side of the room, Tom Skilling busy at work, and he's moaning and groaning about the amount of snow we're going to get. And so is his weather producer, Bill Schneider, who doesn't like the snow. We've got Paul Daly as well working on this storm, and we're going to continue to keep you covered on the snow, no pun intended, um, when it starts, heaviest snowfall, however, will begin on Tuesday afternoon, move overnight, and then Wednesday we'll continue to keep some showers. So let's get right to this forecast. This one is going to be a big one. We've got lots of snow in the forecast, and we're now under a blizzard warning. What does that mean? Well, it looks like you get anywhere from 12 to 18 inches. Heaviest snowfall will be lakeside, where they could be up to two feet. Winds are going to be nasty. Ah, the east-northeast at 25 to 35 miles per hour and gusting around 40 to 50. But even near the lake, they'll have stronger wind gusts. Heaviest snowfall will occur Tuesday night overnight into early Wednesday. Anywhere from 2 to 3 inches of snow per hour and you'll have some white out conditions. So we're already keeping an eye on the radar. We've had some snow throughout the Madison area, Milwaukee area where they've had visibility down. We're pushing in some snow and tonight we're going to continue to be out seeing the snow start. About one to three inches of snow. That is just the start of it. But then we'll have a little bit of a break as this low farther to the south, that's what's going to bring in the heaviest amount of snowfall. So basically it rides a low level jet and it's taking some moisture from the Gulf of Mexico and it'll bring it up into the Midwest and look at what it's doing. It's bringing in watches and warnings, advisories all the way from the Rocky Mountains to the east, all the way up the eastern seaboard where yes again they're going to be hit with a huge storm. But for us, we're a blizzard warning on Tuesday afternoon, and this goes until Wednesday. Winter storm warning, however, right now into Laporte and also into northern Indiana. That could change as well. And here's the model that shows us our future cast of what's exactly going on. This is tonight. We'll see about one to three inches. Some areas, maybe a little bit more than that. Then it'll be a little bit of a lull or a break early Tuesday morning. But then more snow will move right in behind it. And that's when we can't recover. We'll continue to keep heavy snow in the forecast overnight, Tuesday night into early Wednesday. And then Wednesday morning, still some heavy bands set up, especially around the lake. And then by afternoon, we'll continue to keep those winds out of the north. And as that low moves off to the east coast, we're still going to see more snow. So that's where you're going to get maybe the heaviest amount of snowfall on the south side of Chicago and then into northwestern Indiana. How much of the white stuff? Well, I hope you have your plows ready or your shovel sharpened because you're getting a lot of it. Over a foot in many areas, over close to two feet of snow in, um, around the lake. And here's another quick look at our future cast as the snow continues to build in. And the heaviest snowfall, again, will be overnight on Tuesday night and uh, Wednesday. Anywhere from two to three inches of snow per hour could come down. Maybe you'll even hear some thunder out there. And then Wednesday afternoon, we'll still keep some snow around the lake and into northwestern Indiana. So if you're looking about how much in your area, it doesn't make a difference. You're seeing a lot all over the place. Out in Aurora and DeKalb, maybe 13, 14 inches around the lake close to 20 to 24. So we're seeing right now the period of snow starting tonight, one to three inches, some areas a little bit more. Overnight low 16 to 22 with the northeast wind. Remember, blowing, drifting snow, of course, with blizzard-like conditions brings white out conditions. Snow, snow starts to uh, move in on Tuesday afternoon and will stick around throughout Tuesday night, overnight. And then for Wednesday, we're looking at a high of 22, but more snow. It's going to be cold Wednesday night into Thursday. Skies clear out, fresh snow packed. You know what that means? Temperatures bottom out. Could have wind chill values around 20 to 25 below. And then Thursday's high, just 12 degrees with some sunshine. It'll be bright, reflecting off that new snow packed. And then Friday, 18, 26 on Saturday with a little bit more snow. Sunday, unfortunately, it's not the Bears that are playing, but... It'll be a good game, 33 degrees on Saturday.
maybe a little bit of snow in the morning on Sunday. So if you need to get any information when it comes to snow events or if you have some great pictures while it's snowing, send them to chicagoweathercenter.com. Send them to my Facebook, Hammernick's Facebook, Tom Skilling's Facebook, anybody's Facebook, and I'll try to put those pictures on the blog at chicagoweathercenter.com. I'm meteorologist Duffy Atkins, and it's definitely weather.